You know how China seems to be gapping Russia in the space race? Well, back here on Earth, it's a completely different story. Apparently, Russia is currently testing a full-scale mock-up of their new fighter, the Checkmate, a fifth-generation jet that travels at Mach 2. That's twice the speed of sound. And yet maneuvers like a race car driven by Kaichi Tsuchiya. Um, that's the Drift King, by the way. Some would even say it's advanced enough to be a 6th gen aircraft and they aren't too far off, but we'll leave that talk for another day. So in this video, we'll be taking a close look at all there is to know about this new Russian aircraft that's been causing a lot of buzz. Let's get to it! This fighter jet is unique in more ways than one, and Russia is crazy excited about it. The fighter jet was unveiled at the MOX 2021 air show in Moscow on Tuesday with President Vladimir Putin on hand to personally inspect the aircraft. It is their first homemade fifth generation jet with a single engine. The most efficient air force is one that has a good mix of single engine and double engine jets. And in terms of double engine jets, Russia has a fleet of them. They were the go-to for the Soviet Union whenever they needed aircraft, especially during the Cold War. And since then, it's been upgrade after upgrade after upgrade after, well, okay, you get the point. Although you won't find a video of Russian executives discussing this jet in detail, it wasn't exactly a secret. They'd been teasing the jet for a while via Instagram especially. It's funny, they actually teased the jet as a UFO, probably just to amp up the hype, you know. The images they posted had things that we all attached to the UFO by default. And although surely it could have been a coincidence, it's far too suspicious. Single engine versus twin engines. You're probably wondering, well, why is having one less engine a good thing? Way ahead of you, and yeah, we're gonna talk about that. Firstly, Russia had only double engine jets and it was just time to try something new. This quest for modernity would help them discover the perks of having single engine fighter jets too, like the United States. For obvious reasons, twin engines may seem safer because should one have some critical issue mid-air, the other can keep the fighter flying till the pilot lands at base. And this was the norm, twin engines. But then engineers weighed the benefits of double engines and saw it was more beneficial to make engines more reliable and less likely to incur damage than having a backup engine in case something happens. Today, we have the most reliable jet engines and single-engine fighter jets are leading the scene, and understandably so. Firstly, they're lighter, so they have a better thrust-to-body weight ratio than their twin-engine cousins. They're more easily maneuverable because the power comes from one concentrated source, and a change in direction of this source means an instant change in direction of the jet. And with the thruster vectoring of today, maneuvering single-engine fighters will leave you jaw-dropped. We'll talk more on that later. Next, single-engine fighters need less takeoff space, mainly due to the amazing thrust-to-body weight ratio they have. For the US in particular, single-engine jets make up the bulk of their current fleet, and the ones on order from Lockheed Martin, the F-35 Lightning II, known to many as the most lethal, most versatile fighter jet ever produced. Checkmate Advanced Features However, Russia has decided to take the bull by the horn. Their new jet is the fourth, fifth-generation fighter in operation, behind the United States Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor, Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II, and China's Chengdu J-20. The Checkmate is designed as a short takeoff and landing fighter jet, a feature that lends itself to operating from aircraft carrier flight decks and runways damaged by enemy action. The plane has a combat radius of 1,500 kilometers, or 932 miles or the distance a checkmate that's fully laden with missiles and bombs can travel, fight, and then return to base. The plane will have a top speed of 1,180 miles per hour. Sukhoi, in a dig against the F-35, says the checkmate is capable of continuous supersonic flight, a nod to last year's revelation that the F-35 can only fly supersonic for 50 seconds before possibly damaging the plane. Sukhoi claims its aircraft is capable of 8G maneuvers. The engine also has vectoring capabilities, which means that the nozzle isn't fixed at the 180 degree angle from the nose of the jet. Instead, it is able to rotate significantly enough to control both the horizontal and vertical direction of the jet. The result? A highly maneuverable jet that could change direction in an instant. 
The jet would also require less takeoff distance because the nozzle, when pointed downwards, would already be giving some upward thrust as soon as the jet hits the runway. This is especially appreciated on aircraft carriers. And in the air, thrust vectoring allows for sideways movement, so the fighter could literally run circles around opposing fighters in a dogfight. So it's needless to say that Russian pilots would easily gain positional advantage. The Checkmate, like the F-35, can share data in the air with other fighter jets. The new fighter will also come in an unmanned version, opening up the possibility that one manned Checkmate might control several unmanned versions in battle. Fifth generation fighters are loaded with the most advanced tech that has been developed in the 21st century. And the new Checkmate has everything. A top-level stealth technology which makes it virtually invisible to radar, infrared, and sonar. It features an LPI radar, and LPI stands for Low Probability of Intercept. The Checkmate will carry RVVMD and RVVSD air-to-air -air missiles, various air-to-ground missiles like Grom E1E2 or KH-59MK, CAB-250 LGE bombs and S-8 or S-13 rockets. Then there's the Checkmate's claimed unit price of $25 to $30 million. That's less than half the flyaway cost of the F-35, which currently costs about $78 million. The UAC says the first Checkmate will fly in 2023, with actual deliveries of combat-ready airplanes to commence in 2026 or 2027. The Checkmate competitors After all, they must have been used to having the only fifth-generation fighters in the world. But how does Russia's new single-engine Checkmate compare to the F-22 Raptor, the F-35 Lightning II, and the J-20? The F-22 Raptor was created by Lockheed Martin, who built most of the airframe and weapon systems, and Boeing, who supplied the wings, avionics integration, aft fuselage, and training systems. Lockheed Martin also did the final assembly. The result of this partnership was a jet that would travel at about twice the speed of sound, or Mach 2. Its first flight was in September 1997, but it was officially introduced in December of 2005. Its combination of high-tech stealth aerodynamics, avionics systems, made it the first ever fifth-generation fighter jet in operation. Only 195 were ever built before production of the double-engine fighter halted in 2011. By this time, the development of the F-35 Lightning was at full throttle. The F-35 Lightning II is the United States' most advanced fighter for air superiority and strike missions. This fighter really does it all. Electronic warfare, intelligence surveillance, reconnaissance, everything. Its first flight was in December 2006 and was formally introduced in July 2015, although its other two variants, the F-35B and F-35C, would be introduced in 2016 and 2019 respectively. The F-35 Lightning II is a single-engine fighter that focuses less on speed and more on stealth, and this shows in the fact that it has a top speed of only Mach 1.6 and yet features the most advanced stealth tech in the world. So with the US producing the only operational fifth generation fighters in the world at the time, China knew they had to up their game. And in March 2017, two years after the F-35 Lightning II was introduced, China officially unveiled the world's third fifth generation fighter, their double engine Chengdu J-20. Its maiden flight was in January of 2011 at the China International Aviation and Aerospace Exhibition. The J-20 is a top speed of Mach 2.5, and a range of 3,400 miles with two external fuel tanks. As expected, it features China's most advanced stealth tech, armament, and avionics. The J-20 is an impressive aircraft and definitely one for the US, Russia, and, well, the world to keep an eye on. The United States, Russia, and China are at the forefront of aviation development, and they've been there for the longest. However, amongst these three countries, there's a never-ending battle for who holds the top spot without a shred of doubt. The Checkmate is the fastest single-engine jet in the world and Russia's entry into the fifth-generation fighter space. It's a symbol to Russians of the constant development of their country. And it's a reminder to all of us that we should subscribe to this channel to receive updates on aircraft, spacecraft, and technology in general. We'll now draw the curtain on this video. Friends, thank you for watching and have a nice day.